Welcome to another video from DIY Daily. I'm just looking into a fault on this 2008 Renault Twingo today. Uh, the engine light is on the dash and it is having some throttle issues at times where it's not very responsive. Uh, but we've plugged it in and we've got fault code DF079 uh, which relates to the motorised throttle unit. Uh, we've swapped the throttle unit already on this one because uh, we do know they are quite a common issue on these. So here's the old unit. And you can see along this is that this is actually had one fitted a couple of years ago and you can see along this top edge here it's actually water gets on and seeps in the joint and it's all corroded inside you can quite clearly see the state of that there to say it's only a couple of years old as well so um, but i'll put a link in the description below to uh, the part number for one of these units and where you can get them from um, but i'll just show you under the bonnet where it's located um, a fairly straightforward job to do as well so if you want to check yours, if you just come onto the bonnet, so we've got the air box here. Uh, it's just pushed on rubber bungs there. You can see the throttle body at the back here. You need to undo this hose clip there. Uh, and then there's a little breather that you'll need to pop out there. And there's a breather hose on the box there as well, if you take that off. We'll just get the air box out of the way, and then just show you what to show you a bit, but in a bit better view. So just slid the air box out of the way. The only other pipe that uh, was on it was just this one here, but it just pulls off on the bottom there. You can just see the throttle body a lot clearer now. Um, but yeah, it's just got these four screws, uh, four bolts on it. Real easy to access and get out there. And the, the back of it's there with a little connector just around the back that you need to flick off. So as you can see, a real, real easy unit to replace. And you can just check around that to see if it looks like you've had water on the same join. But if you've got that fault code, sort of 90% chance you're looking at the throttle body being at fault really. Obviously you just want to check the wiring connector as well, just make sure it's not corroded in there. But I uh, thought I'd show, share the video with you all. Hope it helped. Uh, if it did, give the video a quick thumbs up and subscribe to the channel.